एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल वी आर बैक विद नदर एपिसोड ऑफ करंट अफेयर सीरीज अपडेट अप टू डेट टुडे वी हैव मोर क्वेश्चंस देन यूजुअल सो लेट्स मोन क्विकली फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन एज पर ए न्यू स्टडी वन इन थ्री चिल्ड्रन वर्ल्ड वाइड आर थ्रेटेंड बाय हाई लेवल्स ऑफ व्हिच केमिकल एलिमेंट इन देयर ब्लड आंसर लेट According to a new study of UNICEF in collaboration with Pure Health, one in three children worldwide are threatened by unacceptably high levels of lead in their blood. The study notes that lead recycling is often done haphazardly in poor and middle-income countries where industrial pollution safeguards are poorly enforced. All right, moving to second question. Who has won the Gulbenkian Prize for Humanity? Answer Greta Thunberg A 17-year-old environment activist from Sweden Greta Thunberg was named the winner of first Gulbenkian Prize for Humanity She was the founder of School Strike for Climate and known as one of the most influential environmental activists We had shared the link of her emotional speech on our environmental day special episode For watching that video click on notification card above Okay moving to the third question Which country had sent Rafael jets to India? Answer: France. The Rafael jets reached Ambala on July 29th. India had bought 30 seats twin engine fighter planes from the Sol Rafael in 2016. As of now, first batch had arrived in Indian Air Force premises which include five aircrafts. Mm, next question. July 27th was the death anniversary of our former president the missile man Dr APJ Abdul Kalam sir the man who taught a youth to see dreams lots of prayers for his soul coming to the question which challenge has been launched by the DRDO on the death anniversary of Dr APJ Abdul Kalam answer dare to dream The DRDO launched a contest to promote innovators in the field of defense and emerging technologies in India on the 5th death anniversary of former president Dr APJ Abdul Kalam sir. The challenge looked forward to promote the individuals and startups for innovation in defense and the aerospace technologies in the country. All right, moving to the fifth question. China launched its first successful mass probe on July 23rd. What is the name of probe? Answer Tianwen-1. China launched its first ambitious Mars rover mission Tianwen-1 on July 23rd aboard Long March 5 rocket from Hainan Island. Tianwen-1 includes a Mars orbiter, a lander, and a rover. Moving to the sixth question, what was the theme of India Idea Summit 2020? Answer Building a Better Future. The 2020 theme of India Idea Summit was Building a Better Future. The summit was hosted by US India Business Council. This year edition marks 45th anniversary of founding the council. Moving to the seventh question. Now, due to lockdown, we are often using home delivery services of various online vendors. It plays a key role in reducing street rush and thus was spreading of virus. Let's look at a question regarding the e-commerce apps. Which e-commerce company has acquired Walmart Incorporated's best price wholesale stores in India? Answer Flipkart. Flipkart on July 23rd announced that it has acquired parent company Walmart Incorporated's local best price wholesale cash and carry business. This will strengthen the e-commerce firm's wholesale offering to compete better with Amazon. Moving to the last question. Indian Air Force is procuring hammer missile from which nation? Answer France. The Indian Air Force has decided to procure hammer missile from France to further boost its combat capabilities. The order is currently being processed by the government under the emergency financial funding to the armed force amid the India China border standoff. That's all for today. Hope you all injected some blood to your veins. comment for improvement like share and subscribe 
I'll be back with another video. Till then, bye bye.